A young man says he opened fire to defend his parents. I'm Shern Min Cha. Welcome back to the 411. Michelle Choi explains why the family says that young man reacted so quickly and decisively. Uh -huh. At a loss for words and holding back tears. Sorry. I see you're getting emotional. Is it because you, you would have never wanted your son in this situation, right? I can say take me in. Dad Alfredo Rodriguez told us this morning he would do anything to switch places with his son after investigators say he shot and killed a man attacking his parents. From what I'm seeing on video and from what everybody's telling me, yes, I mean, he's, he's clearly, you know, taking an action to protect his, his dad and his mom. The shooting took place in the back parking lot of Mexican seafood restaurant Michoacan in southeast Houston just before two this morning. The family was inside the restaurant when Alfredo says a man in his 30s began harassing his wife grabbed her inappropriately. She slapped him. The couple then left and waited outside by their car for their son. That's when police say the man followed them, got in his car, parked in front of them, jumped out and started punching 53 year old Alfredo, knocking him out. Police say he then started attacking Alfredo's 47 year old wife when their son saw this and opened fire. They say one bullet ended up hitting his mom accidentally, but she's expected to make a full recovery. As for the alleged attacker, he was rushed to a hospital where he died. Alfredo says moments later, he woke up. I still remember I see my son on the floor. The police already here. Alfredo says the reason his son was so quick to take action was because of what happened to him four years ago when he was robbed and shot in the face. Alfredo now lives with metal plates in his face. He says since then, his son's vowed to protect him. He tell me that. It never happened to you no more. I take care. Investigators say a surveillance video recording matches the family's story. They believe this is a case of self-defense. They later let Alfredo's son go. We watched as father and son left together. In Southeast Houston, Michelle Troy, KHOU 11 News.